finished up breakfast. First day here, it's a Monday. First week vlog here. Uh, bloody nose at breakfast. California dry air. Not my first time with a bloody nose at breakfast. Probably not my last. Stuff to eat, you get a full plate of hot food, and then you sit there with a napkin towel on your bloody face while the waiter looks at you like a weirdo and you can't eat the food but that's all you want to do is eat <laughs> but your nose is bleeding story of my life time to get to work Yo, we're here at Shake Shack, about to take down the Double Smoke Shack Burger. It is currently my top rated number one burger in the game right now. Also, a great location at this Shake Shack. Uh, we are gonna try it out. It's currently a nine out of 10 rating. Price is the only uh, beef with the Shake Shack thing, but um, quick review coming in. Always get a hot dog on the side. And we were out on the West Coast. We did not get a shot to go to In-N-Out Burger. I wanted to actually get one on the way home from the airport last night, bring it here for a live review double time, but we did not achieve that. So the goal will basically be today to get this, the uh, Shake Shack Burger back in our life. It's pretty dope. And then we'll get In-N-Out next time we go to California. Uh, but we did not achieve it on our trip. But just the fact that I didn't make it a priority to go there means it didn't happen. We did actually get a burger in California at Goodfellas. Just a chain, but it was pretty good. So anyway, about to hit up Shake Shack. Welcome back to Florida. Thank you very much. Thank you. You're welcome. Appreciate it. Okay. All right, sitting down here with Shake Shack. There's only one thing you want to do after a long day of travel. First thing is shower. Second, it's eat. 15 minutes, so it's in the car ride home. So it's not steaming hot, but it's unbelievable. We usually get the hot dog as an appetizer. Get those tomatoes out of there. But today I'm just going straight in on the burger. We'll eat the hot dog after as dessert instead of the appetizer today. First bite, 10 out of 10. Smoke shot. I haven't even gotten to the sauce part yet, which is incredible. Every time I eat one of these, I'm like, why did I get two? And then I remember that they're like $10, but five guys in and out, like, you're behind. You're behind. Five guys isn't even in the same stratosphere. In and out competes on price, not directly on quality, but quality price they compete. There's so only so many foods that you can eat that you get excited for. I go to Shake Shack once a month. And I'm always like, oh man, it's so good, can't wait to go back. A lot of the times those places don't move up to the height. Every time I eat this, it gets better. A lot of don't know many things like that. I'm not even just saying top burger right now, I'm saying it's one of my top five meals. Up there with a burrito. We'll do many food reviews on this channel, but number one seat coming out, coming out firing. I've always said, my biggest fear in life is eating a meal and then still being hungry. Hot dog, perfect insurance policy to make sure that fear never becomes realized. Most important part of any trip. Getting rid of the evidence. <laughs> 